Hey everybody, this is Dorf Dad from OnLiveInformer.com. Uh, tonight we're going to be taking a look at the OnLive Viewer Client for the Apple iPad. Uh, this application is free, it was released tonight, um, and it will allow users, current users of the service to uh, basically browse the arena, check out brag clips, um, make new friends, uh, check your emails, everything except pretty much for playing the video games themselves. So that is going to be possible in the future. Uh, there was It was heavily hinted at tonight, um, but that is not currently available in this uh, client. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go ahead and launch this and walk you through it. Basically it's going to pop up. It's going to ask you for your uh, user account and password information. Once you go ahead and put that in there, you can hit connect on live. takes a second. One thing I do want to tell you guys about, um, th this application is a little bit more uh, laggy. Uh, you see a little more latency in this application than I do on any of the desktop clients or even on the micro consoles. Uh, so when you're using this, just be aware of that. It's uh, not necessarily indicative of how the service is uh, because the service is much faster and smoother. Uh, once again, this is the native app iPad application. You just basically touch everything. Boom, go ahead, brings up our, our dashboard here. I am showing this at a slight angle just for my recording purposes. Uh, hopefully everything comes out all right. One thing we can do is we can just go ahead and tap our friends list and uh, see who's online. Here we go. Let's check this guy out. He's playing dirt. All right, one thing I can do is I can tap right on it, and you notice it pops up, and I can say, send a message. And let's see if we can send him a message here. We'll tell him, smile. You're on video. Close this. And go ahead and hit send. Let's see what happens. See if he responds real quick. See, he's got two spectators right there. All right, we'll see if he uh, comes back to us. We're going to back out of this. We'll see if we get a message while we're doing this. Uh, one thing we can do, you can go ahead and take a look at brag clips. Pretty much anything, like I said, you can do with a desktop client, except for actually play the games right now. I will tell you, the graphics look really crisp and sharp on the iPad's smaller screen. Uh, it would be really, really nice if some point in the future we can take our uh, on-live controllers or another controller whatever it is, and use the iPad as a simple screen to stream our gaming. I mean, that would that would just bring this to mass, critical mass. I mean, I think everybody would love that feature, just having a TV they can walk around with in a remote con and a wireless controller and uh, just play some games. Um, because, it, like, it can, like I said, you can look in here. The graphics look uh, excellent. Uh, they actually look a little bit better on some of these than they do on the PC and that's just due to the native screen resolution sizes. Alright, so let's go back here and see what else we can do. Uh, we can go to the arena just like everything else. You can just scroll left and right like a native iP iPad app. And we can just go ahead and touch on somebody and see what they're doing here. Like I said, you can send messages. Uh, you do, you will notice there's a, one thing I did notice here. You can go to the marketplace and you can see all the new applications that are there. However, the sort button right now doesn't seem to be working at all. You just hit it and it just kind of sits there. I think they want to have the ability for you to sort, sort just like you do on the PC by new releases, but that just currently isn't available. Uh, you can go ahead and click on it. And uh, you know what? Let's try something here real quick. Let's look for an app that we don't have currently. Let's look at Brain Challenge. Uh, I can do free trial. And I can do get play pass, but let's go ahead and launch free trial. Game cannot launch. Launching games is not supported on the online viewer, so they can't do that currently. Let's see if I can go to get get a game pass. Oh, you cannot purchase applications on live with the online viewer as well, which I think they actually should put that on there because if you uh, have your iPad with you and you just spur a moment, go in and look at something and say, hey, you know what, buy that. Should be able to buy it, not play it until you uh, get home on your console or on your uh, desktop. Um, one other thing I noticed here, uh, you can't nat 
necessarily get to your messages right away but what you can do is go to your profile fields and you can just go ahead and hit your messages um, yep we got a, did get a message very nice how is it all right I can delete that all right you can check out what all your friends are doing like I said what's on live you can also go to the coming soon tab uh, you can click on you know a, a streaming trailer eventually you'll be able to watch movies right off of here uh, we had that announcement as well today on live is going to be offering streaming movies in 2011 I can imagine your iPad app is just gonna fire it up just like a voodoo app or um, Netflix and you're just gonna go ahead and watch it so here we go uh, I think that's pretty much it I mean obviously you can do everything else you can add friends you can check out your bride clips you can can do everything except for launch games again let's just try it one more time see what it says yep not not support is not available so that is the on live viewer for the Apple iPad from on live it is available now currently and it is free a uh, great little app if you just want to sit in your bed and, and check out and respond to some emails or maybe catch up on your friends and see what they're doing and watch a little gaming um, also I'd like to ask you guys to uh, subscribe to our YouTube videos number one and number two uh, head on over to our website www.onliveinformer.com uh, we have a brand new form we just set up and we'd love all y'all you guys to come over and sign up and uh, start talking with us about on live uh, and telling us what you want to know about the system and services and uh, we'll try to help you out alright thanks again this is Dorf Dad see you guys on live <laughs>